Absolutely. Well, the, the first thing you learn organizing a union is that people don't join unions for wages and benefits usually. They join for respect. They want to be treated well. They feel like they've been in a system that didn't treat them well. And so fundamentally for us, when we built Honor, it was to make sure that care pros or caregivers were respected. So if you were working at a traditional agency, your schedule depends on your relationship with the person doing the scheduling. So if you speak the same language, if you look like that person, if you bring them cake or ice cream. And so the first piece is making sure that you can access the system regardless of your connection or relationship to a human. Uh, the second thing is the way that you get rated. Right now, in a lot of places, you get rated just by a consumer. We recognize there's implicit bias, and so making sure that the rating system is also recognizes that it is not just consumer review, but how skilled you are, what time you arrive, how consistently you use the app. And so I think that's been really important. And let me never say that wages and benefits are not incredibly important. And because we recognize that most of the women who do this work, it is mostly women and people of color, mostly moms who are trying to do it on their own. And so part of what the tech enables us to do is to charge less and pay more. And so when you look at the starting wage, it actually allows people to be able to support their families and also recognize that people need benefits. And so for us, it's controlling your schedule, making high wages and benefits, but also being able to make sure that the system is designed not for a human to decide how you succeed, but for yourself to decide based on your qualifications how you get paid and what jobs you get offered. Right.